Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you guys so much for tuning in as always. All right, I know y'all are already thinking like, yo, what's up with your hair? Like what you got going on today? Well, this video is not gonna be any different than the title itself, y'all. I am about to color my hair for the very first time. If you follow me on Instagram, which you should, make sure you follow your girl at as told by her underscore underscore on Instagram. So like I said, if you followed me on Instagram, then you know I put out a poll about what color I should dye my hair. I'm gonna go ahead and let you know what color I picked, okay? And that is the bright auburn. Okay, I've never been a redhead, so I'm pretty excited. I've tried to color my hair red a few times, never takes. So I'm putting a lot of faith into Shea Moisture. So this video, I wanted to take you guys along the journey with me as I color my hair. So really quickly, just to kind of preface what I'm going for, I'm hoping that this brown um, takes hold. But if you've ever gotten the box, here is the box. This is the new one. I just learned there's two different Shea Moisture boxes out there. Um, it kind of tells you what your hair may look like, depending on the texture and the color of your hair. So basically what they're telling me is I'm not about to get this really bright look that I hope I get, most likely this one. But y'all, let's hope for somewhere in between. All right, so this is what I'm going for. And you may be asking me about my hair. Basically, I've sectioned my hair off into 12 different parts. Okay, and so I also have them rubber band off. And I only have a box, and I don't know if that's enough. And I've never done this, and I only have 30 minutes to get it done. So my goal is to just kind of do the ends. I'm just gonna shoot my shot. If it doesn't happen, I'm just gonna order some more. I'm gonna go from there. But before I get started, I wanna talk to you guys a little bit about the box, what's in it, why I chose Shea Moisture, all of that. So basically, Shea Moisture is a natural hair care brand, right? So, so it's sulfate. Hey, it doesn't have any ammonia, no bleach. It's supposed to be super good for your hair and it actually has shea butter, I think, in it. Yeah, so, so I'm gonna go ahead and open this box, let you guys know what's in here real quick. In the box, it comes with gloves. You get to your shower cap, a treatment mask for afterwards. This is a developer cream. And so then the actual color is right here. Also in the box, it came with a whole thing of instructions. So my game plan is to follow the instructions <laughs> and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do the bottle method. Uh, the big catch about this whole thing from what I've seen about or what I've seen on other videos is that you got 30 minutes once your product is mixed to put it in your hair, 30 minutes, and then it's not gonna work anymore. It also says that you should leave this on your hair for about 30 minutes, but I have heard that some people have put it on there for longer. So game plan is to leave it on for 40, to color the ends of my hair, and then after that, I'm going to wash and condition. So I'm ready if y'all are, because honey, we in this together, so we about to see what happens. Also something really important to know is that you are not supposed to wash your hair 24 hours prior to applying this hair color. So that's very important. And it's always important to use sulfate free shampoo and conditioner after you have recently applied color to keep the color popping. So hang tight, we're about to get this show started. All right, y'all, we about to do this. I'm not here to play. Gloves. Ooh, I'm getting hot, y'all, because I'm nervous. <laughs> here we go. Ooh, I'm putting it in here. All right, so now we gotta shake it. I'm breathing hard. Okay, here we go. Okay, nothing came out yet. Okay, oh my God. Okay, so as you all can see, it's not coming out. I have no idea what's going on with the lid, but at this point, I'm getting kind of nervous because I don't wanna run out of time. So all I'm gonna do now is just apply the hair color to my hands and stroke it throughout my hair. All right, and my timer has started. I got 30 minutes. All right, I'm doing good on time. All right, now I'm gonna move around. I was watching one video and somebody was like, you know, this is not as easy as people think it is. Let me be the first to say that, okay? Cause I was watching some of these YouTubers and I was like, girl, I can do that. Child, please. I don't see no changes quite yet. Somebody is watching this and is like, we not gonna watch that no more, okay? Yeah, you're tripping. Okay, y'all see it? This is the up close and personal view. Look, y'all not gonna hurt my feelings, okay? This is my first time. 
I told y'all I, I ain't never did this. But y'all know what's really crazy? I think I could have did my whole head. Yeah, I'ma just go for it, you know? I'ma just start putting it everywhere. I mean, I just start putting it all over. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, y'all, so listen, it's a mess. It's getting out of hand. <laughs> I don't really know what's going on anymore at this point. The goal was to do my ends, but I had a lot of extra dye left, even when my ends were done. So, y'all, we're just gonna go for it all and see what happens. If you are worried about time, like I have been worried about time, don't even trip. I've only been doing this for like 10 minutes. All right, y'all, I'm almost done. But I'm gonna get every bit of this red. I want all $20 worth. And for the record, cause I feel like somebody gonna be like, oh, you should've went to a professional. I tried, <laughs> okay? <laughs> uh, she was slow playing and I was like, no, ain't no thing. You know, I'm young and independent and now we're here. <laughs> I see my ends out here trying to change a little bit. I'm just yeah. now at like the 15 minute mark. All right, y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and take my gloves off. Y'all, I still got 11 more minutes. So what I'm gonna do is, gonna add 40 minutes to my timer and let this just kinda sit and hopefully be a blessing. <laughs> 40 minutes and we're going to start it. So while that's going, I'm gonna go ahead and, I should have did this with my gloves on, but I'm gonna go ahead and try to put my hair up under here. All right, y'all, so we're done for now. And I'll be back at 40. <laughs> okay, y'all, it has been 40 minutes. All I gotta do next is go hop in the shower, um, wash and condition oh, y'all. So I will be back momentarily. I am back, y'all. <laughs> okay. Um. So yeah, this is it. Well, I just co-washed my hair, and this is the finished result. Um, a few things. A few things. For my first time, I think I did okay. I mean, I got most of my hair colored anyway, and. Okay, so now for the actual product review aspect of this video. The box, very much true about what you should expect. Not really happy about it, but at least you know they are reliable. Like this is what they said my hair would probably look like and this is what it looks like. Personally, I'm not really feeling it. I mean, I'm not mad at it because it don't look bad and my hair was black and I have some color, but y'all can't even really see it. Yeah, you can't even really tell. I mean, my ends is kind of popping, but so the two things, two things, two things. There was a lot of rinse off color. When I've gotten my hair colored, I've never seen what it looks like on the stylist in but I felt like there was a lot of red coming out of my head. Maybe that's normal, I don't know. I thought that was kind of interesting. The last thing, I had seen another viewer ask in somebody else's video, I don't even remember who it was, but the question was, did it change the texture of your hair? And it did, <laughs> it did. And that was something that I noticed immediately when I looked at my hair, I'm like, hold on, I don't have loose, distinguishable curls. Yeah, y'all, look at this. Y'all see this? I'm like, my hair don't be looking like that. And here, and here. So it's just a lot looser than what it typically, look at that, y'all. It usually would be when I wash it. I wasn't expecting that. So that is something to be wary of. I mean, granted, I'm not too concerned because my hair has changed textures as a result of coloring professionally before. And it's it's come back. It's not that big of a deal. So my game plan is to order another box, okay? I'm gonna do this one more time and we're just gonna see what it looks like. Since my hair's already lighter, it should lighten up again. But all in all, you guys, I succeeded. <laughs> I got most of my hair. So, I 
as far as the process, I think I did well, you know. But feel free to let me know what you guys think at the bottom. I will provide a link where I got this from, the color I have, and all of that. But I got it from Amazon. But I'll put all of that down below. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. As always, as y'all know, better me than you. My next video will be an updated color video. So stay tuned for that because like I said, I'll be doing this for round two. All right. So again, thank you guys so much for watching and hanging in there with me. So thank you guys and I will see you really soon. Bye.